Okay, family. So ghetto news reporter Mary Lee. Don't forget to put that between the Mary and the Lee. I'm in Hyde Park. Now, mind you, I used to stay 5419 South Woodlawn, apartment 1A. There go your rainbow dress. I might have to put that on before it's over with. Look at it. It's flowing. Still ain't got no pink in it, but, uh, you know, once I put it on, it'll make up for all that. Now, I said all that to say, I walked out my door eating a piece of bread, and something told me <laughs> to get off on the bus, you know, on Stony Island a little further down, but I got on the Jeffrey bus. Now, if you can see this, that's 2007 all day. You see the 73? You see the evergreen? You see that? See, it's only one of me. And you can't rob me. See, evergreen plaza, I was making so money, so much money, you know, for all my real Chicagoans, 95th, you know, it used to be evergreen plaza. They, it was a mall at one time, but now they have chopped it up into single stores. I remember one time I was going shopping, and this guy was trailing me, and I'm like, God, me, you know what I'm saying? He pissed me off so bad that I pulled half of my pants down and showed half of my cheek and told him, you know, pretty much kiss my butt. Okay, so you see that. And you see the evergreen. Okay? I said all that to say this. You can't rob God. I don't care who you are. You understand what I'm saying? Real talk. Now, when they railroaded me May 31st, 2008, and they've been railroading me ever since, you know, I end up... <laughs> See, they go to one, the five, the three, and the one. See? See? May 31st is when I got railroaded. See the check? See the building? See the six and the seven? Okay, now back to what I was saying. The second time they railroaded me, I had to, uh, you know, long story short, I ended up reading the Bible, okay? Long story short. You see the Kimberly Lee? See, they always trying to take the Lee out my name for some reason. And my real Mary McAmaris, it's not Mary Lee, it's Mary Dash Lee, okay? Because there's so many copycats out there. Now my uh, foster sister, Kimberly Retton, you understand what I'm saying? She still hasn't shown her face. You see the 1995? That's when I gave open my story in 1995 when I stayed 5419 South Woodline Avenue, apartment 1A in Hyde Park. I can't make this up, but timing is everything. And because my birthday is right around the corner, I'm going to make sure that uh, they know I'm not playing. So I ended up reading the Bible when I went to uh, prison a second time. Okay. Now. You can't, you know, rob God like I said. You see the one, the five, and the, you see the one, five, two, five, it's only one of me. That's my birthday, 525. Now something told me to go in here and give this lady the Bible that I, I read while I was in prison. You understand what I'm saying? I highlighted it, commented it, everything. Which means that Bible is worth a lot of money. A lot of money. You understand what I'm saying? Now, you see the breasts. You see, it's two of them. See? You see the, the breasts hanging out and the child and all that. You see that? All I want to know is, where's my children at? That's all I want to know. For real. Now, I know you want my legacy. All my, you know, so-called Mary McAmyers, for real. You know, what, what made me come and get that lady 
the Bible. She don't work here no more because I looked and she don't work here no more. I'm going to look again. But I know she don't. See, people are trying to retire off my good name and stuff. You understand what I'm saying? My hard-earned money. Memorial Day is May 27th. No, I don't see the lady in there. She was right up in there. She was right there. You understand what I'm saying? As soon as you walk in the door, she's not there any longer. But security is there just in case, I guess, to try to stop me from going in. Look at him. Got his keys in his hand, a white guy, and a gun. So you know we ain't going in there. But whoever has my Bible, all I want to say is hold on to it because I want it back. You understand what I'm saying? For real. I have plenty of Bibles. So uh, don't worry about it. All that trading place shit. It's not going to work on my motherfucking turn. You understand what I'm saying? You're not going to trade places with me, Kimberly Ratman. And I know that was your, 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 uh, your plan. Or maybe Oprah's plan. Either way, y'all both from down south. And you can never outslip the city. So you see it, family, you see it. We ain't looking for no trouble. But you see the police flag all the way up there? Them the ones that's robbing me. See, sometimes you just gotta look up. You understand know what I'm saying? Real talk, like taking candy from a baby. See, I believe, and I'ma say this to the day I die, that Leon Baker Rep was a police officer. I believe that. And I believe his father, who was almost 100 years old, that tried to molest me when I was about nine years old, you know, I believe that was his father. I believe that. You understand what I'm saying? And I believe that's why Mavis Staples and the Staples Singers sung the song, I'll Take You There, with my name in it. All you got to do is listen. It's not saying Kimberly. Is saying Mary. Play that piano now. So I'm playing the piano best way I know how. You know why? Because it's more than one way. To skin a cat, so they say. You understand what I'm saying? We won't get skinned today. See the cat? We all about peace. <laughs> peace.